Imagine, like clockwork, every 22 minutes, a mysterious pulse pierces the cosmic silence and finds its way to Earth. It's not the work of humans, it's a cosmic whisper known as GPM J1839-10, to leaving astronomers baffled and intrigued. What could be the origin of these signals? Could they hold the key to unlocking the mysteries of the universe? Today, we embark on a cosmic detective mission to decode this cosmic message and uncover the truth hidden within the depths of space. But we can't solve this cosmic puzzle alone. We invite you to join the conversation and share your thoughts and theories in the comments below. Together, let's explore the wonders of space and uncover the secrets of GPMJ 1839-10. to So, if you're ready to dive into the unknown and explore the mysteries of the cosmos, hit that subscribe button. Ever wondered how we can eavesdrop on the whispers of the cosmos? Well, the magic lies in a powerful tool called radio astronomy. Picture this. Back in the 1930s, while delving into radio interference, Carl Jansky stumbled upon something extraordinary, radio waves streaming from our own Milky Way. And that's where our journey into radio astronomy begins. Unlike regular stargazing, which relies on visible light, radio astronomy listens to the symphony of the universe. It tunes into frequencies beyond our sight, unveiling cosmic wonders that lurk unseen in the vast expanse of space. In the realm of space exploration, radio astronomy has undergone a monumental evolution. Today, our radio telescopes stand as technological marvels, capable of capturing signals from the farthest corners of the cosmos. Deep in the vast outback of Western Australia, an extraordinary cosmic detective awaits, the Murchison Widefield Array. More than just a telescope, it's a sprawling network designed to probe the mysteries of the universe. Picture this. Across the arid terrain, thousands of antennas form a sprawling array, each one poised to capture cosmic whispers. Behind the scenes, a dedicated team toils tirelessly to keep this intricate system finely tuned and ready to detect even the faintest signals. Their mission? to gather signals spanning a broad spectrum of frequencies, unlocking secrets hidden within different celestial phenomena. Once collected, these signals journey to a cutting-edge data center where advanced algorithms work their magic, transforming raw data into groundbreaking discoveries. Among the array's most captivating findings are fast radio bursts, FRBs. These fleeting bursts of high-energy radiation last mere milliseconds, yet pack the punch of a century's worth of solar energy. Amidst the cosmic symphony of signals, one stands out. GPM J1839-10. Unlike its counterparts, this signal follows a precise rhythm, arriving at Earth like clockwork every 22 minutes for the past 35 years. What's truly baffling is its consistency and endurance. While most cosmic signals are fleeting, this one persists, unwavering in its regularity. Despite thorough investigations, its mysterious pattern remains unchanged, sparking intense scrutiny and debate among astronomers. So, what makes GPMJ 1839-10 so remarkable? Its rhythmic pulse amidst the chaos of space is akin to a steady beat in an orchestra of randomness. Yet, upon closer examination, its waveform defies conventional explanation, adding layers to its enigmatic nature. Numerous hypotheses have surfaced, ranging from spinning neutron stars to powerful magnetars, but none fully satisfy the puzzle. This leaves scientists intrigued yet puzzled, searching for answers amidst the cosmic uncertainty. In the realm of mysterious signals, pulsars often take the spotlight. These cosmic lighthouses emit beams of radio waves, making them prime suspects for celestial communications. But what lies behind the veil of these enigmatic pulses? Pulses are like cosmic remnants, born from the fiery death of massive stars called supernovae, 
They're like cosmic whirlwinds, spinning at incredible speeds. As they twirl, they unleash beams of energy, including radio waves, into space. Picture them as celestial lighthouses, beaming signals across the universe. When these waves hit Earth, our radio telescopes catch them, creating a rhythmic pulse we call pulsars. These pulses are incredibly precise, like cosmic clocks guiding us through the vastness of space. Now let's turn our attention to GPM J1839-1842. Could it be another pulsar in disguise? At first glance, its rhythmic 22-minute beat might suggest so, but dive deeper and you'll notice something peculiar. Unlike regular pulsar signals, GPM J1839 to 1842 dances to its own tune. Its signal doesn't follow the expected patterns and its strength wavers in mysterious ways. What's more, while pulsars typically slow down over time, GPM J1839 to 1842 has remained steadfast for over three decades defying the rules of celestial clocks. Picture it, an earthquake, but on a galactic scale. These cosmic shakes can mess up a magnetar's magnetic field big time, causing it to release energy in the form of radio waves. So, could one of these magnetars be behind our mysterious GPM J1839 to 1842 signal? Well, it's a possibility, but here's the twist. As we delve deeper into the mystery of GPMJ, 1839-1842, we start considering white dwarfs as potential suspects. Now, these guys are the leftovers of stars that have burned through all their nuclear fuel. They're super dense and have pretty strong magnetic fields too, enough to potentially send out radio signals. So, could it be a white dwarf causing all the commotion? The thing is, their magnetic fields, although strong, don't quite match what we're seeing in GPMJ 1839 to 1842. Now let's circle back to the drawing board. Sure, magnetars and white dwarves seem like solid contenders, but something doesn't quite add up. See, the thing about magnetars is they're known for their unpredictability, while white dwarfs, well, they're a bit more stable. And that's where the puzzle deepens, because this signal we're tracking GPMJ 1839 to 1842, it's got this rhythmic beat like clockwork. And that's what's got us scratching our heads. So, what's the verdict? Are we any closer to cracking the cosmic code of GPMJ 1839 to 1842? Not quite. The thrill of discovery, the excitement of unraveling the unknown, that's what makes space science so incredible. But guess what? Our journey doesn't end here. It's just getting started. So if you're as hooked on space exploration as we are, hit that subscribe button and join our cosmic community. Together, we'll dive deeper into the wonders of the universe, exploring every star, planet, and cosmic anomaly along the way. So until next time, keep your eyes on the stars and your curiosity soaring. And remember, the universe is vast, but with each discovery, we come one step closer to understanding its infinite wonders. Stay curious, stay inspired, and keep exploring the cosmos with us. See you in the next video.